we have got lots of rain on radar tracking in from the southwest across Alabama. In fact, it's soaking rain happening now. Tuscaloosa, Northport, pretty much everybody getting at least some rain already today. A spotty showers and storms over northwest Alabama. We'll start around Hamilton and Fayette. Uh, down towards the Ewan areas like that getting a uh, spotty showers and thunderstorms and some of these are locally heavy. They're not lasting very long in one spot. The heavier rain, the more widespread rain just to the south of Reform and Gordo. And that stretches down Highway 82 towards the Northport, Tuscaloosa, out towards the Lake Tuscaloosa, getting quite a bit of rain out of that. I haven't heard of any flash flooding issues, so that's good, but there is some heavy rain out there. Use caution on the highways. Going to be some ponding on the roadways. Heavy rain near Brent and Cinnable, stretching up towards the Montevallo, really up Interstate 65 there from around Clinton back towards the Jemison, uh, Montevallo, areas like that across the Chilton County, Shelby County, and into Jefferson County. Again, near Interstate 65 from the east and west. That's moving off towards the northeast at around 30 miles per hour. So let's go live with our Tuscaloosa Tower Cam. We got some heavy rain falling in Tuscaloosa. Uh, some of the heavy rain just off to the distance. You see that curtain of rain there just towards a downtown uh, Northport. That's where some of the heavy rain's happening right now. A little core rain on radar. In fact, let's go back over to uh, radar and show you what's happening across the area. Uh, go back over to the maps. In fact, uh, there's radar again. That rain's moving through, but notice back to the southwest. It does get lighter, so the heavy rain's not going to last very long, but more rain is likely overnight tonight. Here's that forecast tonight, 70 at 7 o'clock, and again tonight, what you will notice is periods of rain and thunderstorms. Now by 10, uh, some areas will be catching a break. Midnight, uh, more rain is possible. It will be scattered on and off rain pretty much all night, but it doesn't rain all night in one spot. 73 in Tuscaloosa, Linden, also Clanton reporting 73, still mild this evening, but periods of rain will continue. We've had rain most of last night. And again, rain for most of today across Alabama. See some waves of showers and storms continue moving in from the southwest. This pattern will continue all week and into the first half of the weekend. Rain total so far 0.66 in Tuscaloosa, but notice here down to the south, some extreme flooding issues happening along the Gulf Coast of Mobile area down towards Biloxi, Pensacola. Lots of rain reported there over the past 48 hours. And again, this will continue over the next several days. Have that umbrella handy all the way through the rest of the week and again into the weekend. Uh, 60s tonight, 70s tomorrow, scattered showers likely tomorrow and again. I don't think it's going to rain all day tomorrow or over the next several days. But have that umbrella handy at any point. Tip to stop out in the 70s lows in the 60s.